even though Faru Abraham thinks that Dean Mom is too fake to win a Critics' Choice Award, she definitely has a higher opinion of herself than she does of the franchise that made her famous. Faru Abraham tells you exactly what she thinks of herself on her profile on this new app for connecting people. Honestly, her self-description is wild. And Farah also describes the sorts of people with whom she's looking to connect. But she claims that she's not trying to hook up or date. Sure. Radar Online interviewed Farah and got a hold of her Bumble profile. International celebrity, teen mum on MTV, business mogul, New York Times best-selling author, advocate for safe contraception, owner, founder furnished by Farah, Frocco, Sophia Loron. These are so much to absorb, so let's go through them item by item, okay? International celebrity. Technically? Sure. You can be an international celeb without being A list. Or B list. Or C list. Teen mom on MTV. So she's having fun bashing MTV at every opportunity, but she's clearly not above dropping the name of the successful franchise that made her the woman she is today. Business mogul. A mogul is defined as an important or powerful person, which is not how we would describe Pharaoh Abraham in our wildest dreams or most twisted nightmares. The rest of that? Fine, we'll give it to her. But Farah's profile has more to say. This time, it's about the sorts of connections that she'd like to make. Love to connect with smart, intelligent, creative, and open-minded people. Is she looking for open-minded people who won't judge her for her sex work? Because that's fine. Or is it Farrow Abraham's racist insults that she's hoping that people will accept? Farrow also explained to Radar Online what her totally non-horny purpose was for joining Bumble. I joined Bumble Business, but I see they've Bumble BFF and Bumble Dating. We think that she's referring to Bumble Biz. We can't bash the name. Because a lot of people have done very serious networking on Twitter. An app's name needs to be memorable, not serious. I've only so far enjoyed the business events in Austin with other company owners and entrepreneur creative events. Gee, you'd almost think that the whole interview might be some sort of elaborate product endorsement. We're kidding, that it was clear from the start. I have no time for dating right now. Well. She's still sort of a teen mom OG star, she's an actual mom, she's starting a lingerie line, and she's doing endorsement deals like this shameless Bumble plug and also named ambassador for sexual positivity. If Farah's really using the app, she should know that, though we can't speak for Bumble clientele, a lot of the times, men who say that they're fine just being friends are actually lying. It's easy to see some dude seeing that she's on, being curious about a, minor, celebrity, and stumbling across Farrow Abraham's camp-girling adventures. 